Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Beat missile or aircraft or UAV. Nothing will work without satellite navigation. The US uses GPS, Russia uses GLONASS and China uses Baidu for their civil and military navigation system to meet the positioning, navigation and timing requirements of the nation. ISRO has established a regional navigation satellite called Navigation with Indian Constellation or NAVIC in short. NAVIC was erstwhile known as Indian Regional Navigation Satellite System or IRNSS. NAVIC is designed with a constellation of seven satellites and a network of ground stations operating 24 by 7. The ground network consists of control center, precise timing facility, range and integrity monitoring stations, two-way ranging stations, etc. NAVIC offers two kinds of services. First one is a standard position service for civilian users and second one is restricted service RS for strategic users. The NAVIC coverage area includes India and a region of up to 1500 km beyond Indian boundary. The NAVIC signals are designed to provide user position accuracy better than 20 meter and timing accuracy better than 50 nanosecond. The NAVIC SPS signals are interoperable with other global navigation satellite systems such as GPS, GLONASS, Galileo and Baidu. On 29th March 2023, ISRO completed a very important mission. It launched its second generation NVS-01 navigation satellite into space which is fitted with sophisticated navigation payloads which can operate in L1, L5 and S frequency bands. The first generation NAVIC had only L5 and S frequency bands. This launch is a significant step towards the best and most advanced navigation technology in India. The NVS-01 satellite is equipped with indigenously developed rubidium atomic clock. The use of indigenously built atomic clock was a major technological achievement in India's space exploration. Earlier, scientists relied on imported rubidium atomic clocks to obtain the accurate time and position information. This satellite will replace the IRNS 1G satellite launched in the year 2016 which is part of a constellation of seven satellites providing navigational services to Indian region and is expected to have a life of 12 years. NAVIC has both commercial and defense applications. It can be used for logistics, GPS and mobile phones, railways, etc. and can generate billions of dollars in revenue. While India has its own navigation satellite, there is a need for indigenous chip to support it. Recently, a major step was taken forward in this direction by a Bengaluru-based space technology firm called Elena Geosystems. In April 2023, the firm has unveiled a chip that could form the course of navigation, positioning and timing applications in India. The chip works with navigation with Indian constellation NAVIC and the chip has many cores that serve the requirement of signal acquisition, regeneration, processing and output interface and hence it has been named as NAVIC processor. This chip will enable high precision and accuracy for all three types of applications such as navigation, positioning and timing making India self-reliant in this domain. The company has been pursuing advanced technology to manufacture these chips and modules, some of which have been supplied to Indian Army and some private entities. The processor will give India a huge edge as both government and private sector can move away from their dependency on American GPS. The military-grade chip can be used in a wide array of applications on land, air and water. For the Defence Forces, the chip can be used in handheld devices for operational logistics in ships, submarines, radars, drones and artilleries. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind.
we'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.